I'm drinking vitamin C water. I really upset. I was supposed to go get a beauty treatment today at Sculpt LA, but I wanted to tell them I was kind of not feeling my 100% self, and they're like, why don't you, we'll reschedule when you feel better, Lauren. I was like, oh, because apparently, I didn't know this, that your immune system, when you do these beauty treatments, has to be like, oh boy, number one, number one immune system. Uh, so I'm here. Hi guys, hey Mackenzie. Somebody asked, I'm not looking for any, right now I'm looking for a maid a housekeeper to come and clean my kitchen. I had a friend, um, actually a, like a distant relative staying here for a few weeks and basically he made a mess, such a mess. Um, he left in like the middle of the night and uh, left pizza boxes and bags of garbage and I'm just like, oh, what are you gonna do, right? What are you gonna do with family? So. Now I'm just making my breakfast and drinking some coffee. Anyone have advice for a runny nose and a sore throat? Asking for myself. Miss you too, Mackenzie. I'm drinking some hot coffee. I don't understand what language you are speaking, but okay. I am making George's breakfast. George gets breakfast first. George, where'd you go? Babe? George? George gets a hamburger. Just waking up. No, I've been up for about a few hours, but this cold, I have been walking so slow and forgetting things. Like, I like thought that I put the, the George's food in the toaster and I'm like waiting for it. I'm waiting for it. You ever guys ever do that? And then I realized I didn't put his food. I was thinking about putting the food in the toaster. So yeah, drink tea with honey. That's a good idea. Yeah, and I just, like, I hate staying in bed when I'm sick. And then it's raining here, which we need rain. But, of course, I picked up some giant furniture. No, Robert, I got, I did a test yesterday. It was negative, thank God. Oh, says there's a person at my front door. That's scary. Hopefully it's no one I know. Hopefully it's a... <laughs> nice meeting you. What's up, New Zealand? And thank you for sharing this, guys, that we get new people watching. I love that. I love it. I am just cutting the meat up. Cutting my meat. And talking to you all. Local honey and vitamin C. That is a good idea. Yes. Oh my god, thank god. I know Mackenzie. That's I was just worried too. I was like, if I have to tell all my friends that I have that, they're gonna be mad at me. But I just uh tested right away right away. I have all those tests. I remember the government was sending free tests. So, and I felt bad because a lot of my friends were doing like after AFM parties, but I was just like, I need to rest. <laughs> I need to relax. I need to like hang out in my, in my bed. All right. I cut all the, the meat up for my dog. I give my dog home cooked food. George, where'd you, let me go find him. I'll be right back, guys, don't go in there. George? There you go. I feel like George is getting a little jealous of Lola, so that's good. Lola was my friend's dog. Oh, my cat is eating, that's cute. I like watching the meat. I wonder, I'm like, how do you get a stray cat to come inside? Do I like trap him and like be like, okay, that's it. You're in the house now, or you're staying in my house. They, oh, thank you. You still think I look nice even though I'm sick. Bye. Oh, I put your candle soup in the fridge. Do you want that? Oh, okay. Alright. I didn't know if you were looking for it. Okay. Alright. No worries. My other friends. Uh, okay. 
Alright. I gotta scramble the eggs now. Oh, okay. Oh boy, guys. Are you married? No, not married. I live with a ton of friends, though, because I don't like living alone. Um, so I do have a ton of friends living here with me. Um, yeah. I wish I had a, a, a girl living here, because then I could be like, let's make breakfast together. I want my friend Louisa to come visit again. Do you guys remember Louisa? I gotta call her and be like, Louisa, you need to come visit. <laughs> I should text her and see how she's doing. I am making eggs. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Michael. You're sweet. Save my eggshells and put them into the ground. Feel better. Thank you, Mackenzie. Thanks so much, guys. Yep, I was like, you know what? I should just make breakfast with everybody. And say hello. Cutting, cooking some eggs. What are you guys doing today? What's on your agenda for the day? I'm trying to figure out a way. I gotta organize all my closets here because of all the shopping that I do. I need to um, figure out how to organize my shoes. Does anyone have shoe organization advice? I just have too many. It's really hard to say no to a cute pair of shoes. It's like you can never have too many of them, right? Or no. And I'm excited because I get to wear rain boots. I don't even know where they are, but I'm going to find them because it's raining finally in LA. Like, yes, we get wear rain boots. Oh, was it holiday today, Mackenzie? What day is it? Is it like, what kind of holiday is it? Thanks, Dan, I have your ring on. I love this ring. Thanks, Thomas. How are you doing? Good to see you. I'm here. You should just wrap up and make sure you don't get a chill. Yeah. Taking and burning leaves from about 30 trees. Oh, James, that's, you know what? That's what I should be doing at my parents' lake house. <laughs> should be burning some of the tree. Ooh. <laughs> that was... I picked up this pot somebody had in there and I just got like a splash of water and went like this. I went, like got water in my face. Oh. Why? I'm gonna sneeze. A chew. A chew. No, I'm good. Oh. Uh. Too. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's election day. That's why you're off. Uh, with all my sickness, I forgot about voting. I have to do that later today. Ugh. Just feeling so yucky. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome, Mackenzie. Nice guys, nice. I'm gonna see about making other stuff too. I've been making this like um, thing that my friend uh, Nikki showed me how to make. What is it called? I forget what it's called. It's called like, oh no, I'm gonna sneeze again. <gasps> It's like with flour, eggs, and corn. I've been addicted to making it, but I haven't figured out. She does a better consistency than me. Okay. Oh, I did that already. See, I keep forgetting. I'm like, what did I do? Bless you. Yes, George. Yes, George. So yeah, my friend left his dog's food. What's up, baby? You wanna say hi? He looks confused. 
He's like, where is everybody? Yes, Mackenzie, yes. Okay, I get some cheese. Oh. Finding eggs, that's good. <laughs> what are these? Is this good? I don't know if, like, the salsa in the fridge is good. Some onions. There was peppers, actually, but the peppers were not good. I'm trying to use everything in my fridge. I chew, I'm going to sneeze again. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hi, Brian. Oh, I'm sick, guys. Oh. What's up, George? I'm trying to combine. Oh, there's only one egg in here. Okay. So you're getting rid of some trash. Okay. Love you. Thank you, James. Thank you. Superstar chef. Cooking in the kitchen. Mm. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna have to flip my omelet soon. Ugh. I don't know, I'm, I need to blow my nose too. Hold on guys, I'll be right back. baby. Thank you, guys. I feel like a poor baby right now. I'm just so sick. Oh, boy, guys. So, I'm making breakfast. What are you all doing? Hot herbal tea. That's a good idea. Onions and tea? Did, you, did I just read that right, Thomas? I don't know if I read that right. What did you say? Lemon and onions and herbs in tea, Thomas? I don't know. Get eucalyptus Epsom salts. Oh, that's a good idea. I have some uh, essential oils. I should smell those. Uh. Mm. Yes. Miss you too, guys. I miss you too. I'm gonna go. I was gonna. Go. I gotta go to the post office today. I got a lot to do. Oh, you're making chicken curry for dinner. That sounds good. That sounds really good. All right, guys. You cook well. Thank you. Okay. All right, guys. All right, my eggs are done. They don't look really pretty, otherwise I would show it to you. Oh boy, they're just crumbling everywhere. They're not, they're not very good eggs. Not good eggs today. I don't know what happened. It's like all at the bottom of the pan. I hate when that happens.
Oh boy, guys. Now I'm gonna make the flower thing. I think arepa. That's what it's called, an arepa. Now I'm gonna make some uga. That was almost dangerous. I almost dropped the fork on my foot. Uh, welcome, guys, to my live stream. I think I'm gonna end this soon and just uh, eat my breakfast, but I'm just uh, making a side dish right now. So, I'm gonna add some flour to my arepas. Miss your beauty, thank you guys. I miss you too. All right. Loved your Halloween outfits. Thank you guys. Any other characters you think I should dress up as? I had a lot of people say nurse, doctor, uh, pirate. Um, what else did I get? Space girl. <laughs> I actually got a space girl outfit, new one. At, um, at the Party City store after Spirit, like after the holiday, everything goes on sale. So I just bought a bunch of costumes. Um, but yeah, guys, if you have any like requests for costumes, I'm gonna start uh, doing them on my Instagram every day. Different costumes. All right, mixing the flour. Nurse was super hot. Oh, okay. So you think nurse again? Maybe you guys can uh, pick out different costumes because I need a different one. Rub the pan with lemon and baking soda and then cleans. Oh, that's a good idea, Charles. What's up? What's going on? I'm just making some arepas now. Oh. Dallas cheerleader. You know what? When I was a little girl, I wanted to be a Dallas cheerleader. That was what I wanted to be when I grew up. <laughs> So that would be like, that would just like fulfill like all of my dreams. <laughs> I need to find a vintage Dallas, cheer Dallas cheerleader outfit. Oh my God. Can I put that on my wish list? <laughs> Imagine like going to my PO box and look what I got. And I think Carlos is from Texas. So he's a big Dallas fan. I could get him to like, maybe like uh, take the pictures or find somebody. I, I gotta get a friend here. Actually my friend Steven Zarita, I don't know if he's watching. He takes a lot of my photos. He's it's, he's he's from all, he's from well, I don't know where what part he's from some part of Texas, um, but I feel like all Texans are Dallas fans. I don't know. Oh my goodness, that would be so. That's a good idea, Brian. If anyone has shoe organization ideas, you guys let me know. I'm working on that. That's my next uh, my next project is my shoe closet. I have to figure it out. My closet downstairs is just a disaster of like shoes. I got a bunch of really tall amour amours though. So I'm trying to figure out, I have to, and I was gonna paint them like I painted the other ones. And uh, <coughs> of course it's the only time it started to rain. <laughs> oh, Brian said I can't stand the cowboys, but you like the cheerleaders. <laughs> All right, making my arepas. Arepas. Oh, George, my doggy is looking for me. All right. My eggs are gonna get cold, guys. I better um, start to eat. I'll come back later. I missed you, I promise. Uh, I gotta figure that out. Maybe I'll do like an Amazon Live and figure it, go through stuff I want. And you guys can help me make decisions. I like that. Ooh. That's bad, I dropped an onion on the ground. Is my cat still outside? No, my cat's not. It's really, my pool is green too. I've kind of given up. I feel like just putting, guys, what are your advices for pools? I mean, like I need experts. Cause my pool has been green for the last month. I feel like just putting a cover over it and being like, okay, pools and it, like, does that stop it from turning green? Probably not. But at least like, I won't have to like use the, what is that thing called? The the skimmer all the time and put so much chlorine in it. I'm like over it. Like, how do you keep it? Take vitamin C and drink orange juice. Oh shoot. That was crazy guys. Wow. Did you see that? That's my life guys. My life is a vintage cooking utensil that just broke. Let me wash it before I put it on my egg. 
Oh my goodness, the rain. Hey Lauren, haven't been on here for three years. Thank you. Good to see you from the UK. You know, I feel like I haven't been on here in three years. I have, um, uh, oh, thank you, Glenn Newley. I was dealing with a broken phone for about three months and I was being stubborn. Like, I would use my mom's phone occasionally when I could, and, but I'm not, you know, or my friend's phones or my roommate's phones. And finally, I just bought, I, I, I bought the, I bit the bullet and I got a new one. I should have got it sooner. But I, thank you, Glenn Nunley. Did I say it right? But I was waiting for the new phone. Because I always, like, my phones always break right before the new ones come out. And then, like, I end up getting the old one, the old newest one. The one day I am done. Sorry to hear that I'm sick, too. Tom, what do you have? I have, um, don't let the drunks drink the water. The raccoons do, Glenn. The raccoons. My raccoons are... I have a family of four raccoons that live here. They're pretty damn cute. <laughs> They're pretty damn adorable. Alright. Alright, guys. I love you all. Alright. I think it's a cold. Yeah. But how long do you think till I get better? You know? That's what I want to know. When am I going to get better? When am I get better? So that's all. 